Cue the ominous scary music. Because in this video, we visit a brand new tank added to War Thunder that's basically an oosh with extra ammo. Hi guys and welcome back to the channel, Gaijin have done it again, they've added another vehicle with this crazy rocket launcher system but at a lower battle rating. Now if you're wondering what the hell this thing is, it's pretty simple, this little Swedish car was added way back when Sweden was and it has a drum auto loaded rocket launcher with over 300 millimeters of pin. Now the German version is actually a lower BR, it's not on a wheeled chassis so it has some advantages and disadvantages we'll talk about later. It also has three crew members instead of two and a good bit of armor in the hull, enough to stop 50 caliber machine guns killing you, which the Oosh had the problem with. Now this weapon system is extremely toxic, you've got good gun depression on this version too, negative 10 degrees of gun elevation, a 0.4 second reload, that's for each tube by the way, so every 0.4 seconds each tube can fire a rocket, you can bind them individually as well which is also insane and this guy gets an additional rack of rockets, that's 9 each. So 36 rounds of ammo you can spam on a JPZ-45 chassis that's not quite as fast as a JPZ-45 or the RU-251 fortunately enough, but it does have enough armour up front to stop 50 cals, just not from the side or the gunner's face either. Now where the Oosh was kind of lacking in the mobility department, it was hard, you can't neutral steer a wheeled vehicle of course, this thing can and it does it very well. Much better than the Oosh does, the only disadvantage is you're not quite as small a profile as the Oosh, which makes you an easier target to hit, most things are going to pin you, some stuff will overpin and you will survive, but most of the time it's going to take out two crew members or hit your ammo or cripple your vehicle and then you're out of the match. But as I always say, the best way to play War Thunder is not to get shot at all and when you've got 36 rockets with this amount of penetration, you can be extremely overwhelming to the enemy team. Now I'm sure it'll come at no shock to you, we got a nook today, actually we got three, we had some really good games and some really slow ones as well where I got even more nooks, but I want to show you the two most exciting games I had in this thing, because of new patch day, a lot of people are in new vehicles, they won death leave and it's not really good YouTube content, but luckily I jumped on today for a couple of games and back to back we got some absolute beauties, I hope you guys enjoy this footage, let's get into battle. Right dude, here we go, I think this is 7-7, seven, seven. let's see what we can do. Might say so. That was a fancy traitor. Surprise there's not a noose here. This is not the most ideal map for these rockets. A lot of mess. Like the the monument I'm going to is technically a bad idea. What are these two hoodies up to? I think I'm just going to make a run for monument. Because there's no one else going there and if the enemy team get there before us is GG for our entire team. What am I hearing here? Is it just the hum of the helicopter? That's a BTR, right? It's a BTR I just heard. Okay, we're locking this down. I think I hear an enemy in that corner over here because the new sound engine is crazy. I don't think it's a new sound engine, what I think they've actually added is a fake engine noise. Don't really think I can hit this guy, I can't. Can we see the guy up on C? Yeah, kinda. It's that object 120, just reversing. Okay, he's trying to hit me back. That didn't work out. And no one has pushed me here yet. I think I had that tree but Oh, this is really not good. It's a Praga. Right, who's the who's the guy here? Okay, we got a kill assist on the 120. But there's a guy trying to kill me from the C cap. I need to be careful with how many rounds I have left. Oh somebody got him. It's another BTR. I need to be careful how many rounds I've got left in the the left tube. Tube. And there's someone very close to me. Or so I think. He actually might not be. Yeah, there's one over there. Did, did I just get shot at? I'm gonna try and pick this guy. 
Okay, that was all the left, uh, sorry, the right tube. And we're reloading. Th this thing is nuts, dude. This is such a very good defensive tank. No matter who there is, is shooting at somebody. I don't know who. Now, we've not been surrounded yet, which I'm really surprised about. Where is this guy firing from? D down this way. No, no idea. My teammate's just been deleted on the other side. Ah, oh, they're there. They're all in the corner. The, the usual suspects. And th there's definitely an enemy close to me. Unless it's this T-114 making all this racket. Is that an R3? It was an R3. Okay. I didn't see that guy, but he's also dead. I don't know how I didn't see him, because he's massive. There's not another one over here, is there? That thing is dead, I'm sure. Oh, hey! A body! Where are you going, sneaky boy? Driver radio. Exploded. And we're backing off again. We still got plenty of ammo. I always feel like I'm playing the Oosh when I'm in this thing. Like, you know, we're quite limited on how much we can actually do, but... By the way, artillery seems absolutely giga now, so I'm going to be very careful of this. Right, that's... Oh, my friend, he's finally turning up. Good job, lads. You missed the fight. Yeah, that already almost killed us. Can't see a thing. So our turret rotation speed is even slower than it was. What is this, French? Can't be. T-44. God, what a brave soul! Right, we're getting B. <gasps> Enemy. He crossed. The barbed wire seems to set off our rockets. Oh, here's a ZSU-57 too. Can I overpressure him if I hit something nearby him? No, I can't. Maybe I should have... some HEs. Stupid barbed wire, dude. At a pole now. I'm trying to sneak it underneath a bit, I can't. My teammate's gonna pick that up for sure. Okay, maybe not. The 57-2 is big angry, there he is, he's gone. But there was a guy with a machine gun over here, and a ZSU-57-2 does not have a machine gun. So... I wanna get blown up. I need to move, I need to move. There might be an enemy at this side, and uh, my turret rotation speed is being uh, a bit nerfed due to some recent damages from artillery, which is exactly the reason why I'm moving away from there. We are an entirely red crew. Not great. Could be better. Plane coming? For me? A double barrel there. There's another one to my left. Oh, we are so dead. Never mind. <gasps> Never mind, dude. I slammed my suspension down quick enough to get him. This thing is so stupid. There's an ELC bus on B. Can I get away with cutting this corner? Looks like it. Where's the... Where's the disco biscuit at? I think that's who we saw cutting across earlier. He died. And that's friendly there, I'm sure of it. God, there's so many enemies left. This jet is gonna definitely kill me. If I get spotted, that is. Another SPA. And there's a guy in front of me and one behind. Now, where did this dude go? Dude, I'm driving so slow because of 
the damage I've taken. There you go, this street? No. Next one. There's another one in front of me. Where is he? Okay. And where is this guy? I've got one rocket left. One rocket, not ideal. How many? It's one. Oh my god. We have 11 kills. This guy's gonna come out of here, right? He doesn't know whether he should push or not. He just fired. Is he gonna shoot again? He did shoot again. And again. Actually, where is he? I got his loader and that's it. My ammunition storage is empty. Right, you hit me. Okay, and I think if someone kills that big boy that we just crit we can definitely oh we can spawn a cam better anyway let's go we're gonna go coastline beauty spot dude let me take a quick sip of uh, water there's an SU9 up who will probably know my existence and I don't think we stand a chance against it but one we don't have the cannons on this thing and two, it's faster than us and turns better at high speed. The SU-9 is chasing our 262. I actually don't think that plane is going to know I've got a nuke, do you know that? Fly the tank battlefield. <laughs> okay. It would be nice if that disappeared after a while. This 262 is coming to me. Please don't do that. Right, so I think I'm being sneaky, but I might not be. Okay, we are being sneaky, it's fine. My teammate is flying this guy. Far too close for comfort. Bombay door is opening. And... We're tossing it. <laughs> it's gone, dude. It is gone. I chucked it out of the map. My teammate's trying to kill me, look. Testy Torshi. Where is the bomb then? This comes to stupid. <laughs> okay. GG's. It's to be expected from this thing, right? There he is, look. Mr. Fancy Canberra. Wee. I'm guessing. 70,000 silver lines and I'm being like quite generous to myself let's see what it actually was it is oh no I was right <laughs> that's awful dude thank god this change is coming soon oh gg all right interesting map snow which means a turbo mode and we are against Russia France yikes the two nations this thing seems to struggle against the most spaced armor on versus these why are you shoving me <laughs> the space armor versus these uh, rockets is abysmal whoa brazil how is that spa scouted from way back there oh an is2 just yeeted a friendly right next to me here so i want to get down in this little dip there's so much we can do from this little hill especially with a panther 2 kicking about with us nice i hear a missile a, a, a scorpion kill with a tiger too. Brazil is with us too. <gasps> Holy moly! It's all the T-44s. Okay, TLC bis exploded. Hold still, Mr. BMP. He's like, he's turning a twist and dude. You can, you can run but you can't hide, apparently. Just keep spamming my left mouse button until you're dead. Right, we get one rocket left in this. And there's a... 
Praga coming up this way. Oh, my tiger got to drove out a bit too far, it would seem. And he got murdered by a Frenchman. Oh, hey, there's a guy here. Right. I'd like to say I saved my teammate, but I think I might have stole his kill. Where's the Praga? He's dead. Is there really no one coming this way? Oh, there's a plane coming in, I think that's for me. Oh, hey. I did. Finally. Oh, he's... Is that an Object 120? I think it's an Object 120. Oh, I heard the shot coming. That may be the IL-2. Or it might be the French thing. Where did that come from? Now I'm pretty confused. The object is here. And yeah, yeet. Stop moving. Right. We don't need no auto-loaded thing if you have a drum full of giant rockets. There's an enemy here again. I can't really move from where I am. This guy coming for me. No, not yet, but he will be. And I think we just got stratosphere bombed as well. So I'm going to drive away from here. I think it's a great idea to hang around. Ah, you're there. Am I safe here? I mean, the answer is no, but we just got to have to make a run for it. There's definitely a lot in here. We're not safe anywhere right now. He doesn't shoot it. Oh, there's two of them here. I'm getting bombed. Oh, he's getting bombed. Right, did the other guy next to him explode? I don't think he did. Oh, he's here. He has absolutely no idea what's happening to him. And the airplane is now where? Coming after me? Dude, this thing is so toxic. Most times you're like, all right. We missed a shot on someone, so we gotta back off and get a follow-up shot later or the person gets to fire at you next, right? So there's some sort of like tit for tat. <laughs> but this thing you just keep spamming your both mouse buttons and then it's over. Where is he? The fake engine noise is really annoying, right? But it does help in situations like this where you absolutely should not be hearing someone, but you do. I don't even know if that's friendly next to me. Something's broken on my tank, I need to fix it. I, I've, tried, I've gone this long without having to repair it, so... Oh, he's behind these buildings over here. Ooh. Horizontal drive. I'm trying to use my right hand side gun right now because we're gonna end up depleting the one that's actually accurate at long range. Unless I switch my scope. Oh, so this guy got my Panther too. I'm gonna go after him. I think he's coming in here to hide from the aeroplanes. No SU6, get away from me. The AMX is here. Oh, you're up there, actually. Dead. And I think there's another one, no. I'm going to get sniped with the IS-2 again. And this time he won't survive. I've not got enough crew. Where is this guy? Oh, he's here. We... We double-barreled. Right, okay. We're, we've got ammunition problems now. Go away. The aeroplanes hate me. This is so dumb. I don't know if my teammates are actually going after the planes. I think I hear another one. I could crew the plane, but I'm literally the kingpin of our whole team right now because no one else is out here. But I'm going to get exploded by an enemy aircraft at some stage in time. 
There are so many enemies. Yeah, it's happening now. <laughs> Tried to hide behind the building. That guy deliberately snaked me, dude. <laughs> right, I guess we go 262. It's a... I mean, I, I could try and get a nook. But with that many planes up and we've got... We're doing the stupid thing, I guess. I don't want to be... Getting too aggressive. A Praga. I would be getting too aggressive when we're so close to a nook, dude. We're like five kills away. Our P-51C... Killed a Wurble one somehow? I don't know what my team is doing. It's all very bizarre right now. I'm not seeing anyone sniping. My teammate is getting too close to me and I really don't want him to be. I need to hear. Okay, good job, Tiger. There's a plane. And unfortunately, our good SPA jade out. Might be over. Load our track and that's it. He's range finding me. That was close. And now there's an enemy right in front of me somewhere. In a Praga. Which is possibly the worst thing. Okay. Disintegrated. And now... There's a guy behind us. Down here. I don't want to run these trees over, but I need to see as well, so... Please just get squished, thank you. Oh, we did, we did, we did. Luckily, he wasn't paying attention. Okay, I don't think he can shoot us with his flags anymore. Okay, we got a kill assist. Enemy there. AMX 1390. I hear this plane, dude. What is this plane doing? Oh, he's coming for me. No! Okay. I managed to angle. If he was flying like that, I'll definitely hit him with a rocket. Hide. We're dead. Thank you, teammate. What is that? ITP or something? I don't know. But I'm scared. I'm definitely scared. Who just shot you? An IS-2 from back of beyond. He's coming back. This is... It was so jover, dude. It's so jover. Ah... Uh, right, well, it's airplane time for me, I guess. <laughs> it's, it's all over for you, dude. We're taking out the, the wild card. They, they asked for it, dude. That was, uh... Was that twice I got killed? With an airplane? Yeah, they, you deserve it. You deserve what's about to happen. <laughs> We're top down at everything. We're actually losing, though, so... That's not brilliant, obviously. This guy is mega slow, and I refuse to be that slow... ...with him, so... We have to be quite tactful what we're doing here, and... ...avoid all Praga. No more Yak-3. Right, where is the IS-2 that's out here? My teammates keep complaining about. My medium tank is going for the cab. I don't know why he's doing that. We got two enemies crossing this field in front of us. One looks like a tank destroyer. Let's buzz both of these. No, yes. No, the guy, my teammate doesn't know there's a guy behind them. Okay, I have damaged him enough that he can't push up, but he got killed by an IS-2 enemy, my teammate. Oh dear, so it's me, a heavy tank, and an M42 that's left. 
Not brilliant. Gotta be honest. Oh, my jumbo got the side shot on that lad. Amazing. He's in trouble. The jumbo might get to him next. Let's get the IS-2 because that's the other only thing that can kill our jumbo coming up over the hill right now. The SU is moving again. Right, IS-2 is in deep trouble, but his gunner's still alive. And he still killed my jumbo anyway. Great. Uh, maybe, maybe this is not happening. I'm waiting on a plane, but it's not coming. My ASU is this, the one I was killing before. He's recapturing the B cap. Not anymore. Let's come. Let's get that guy first. And then we'll restrafe the IS2. Where's my SPA? Are you fighting someone? No. Did the AMX die? Okay. My 109 chose to strafe an IS-2 instead of the thing I just killed. Amazing. No retaliation yet from the air. The IS-2 is looking to crew replenish, I think. He certainly was. And what was that? We're actually getting this back a little bit. There's three enemies left. The enemy's not made an attempt on the A cap, I'm surprised. And my teammate was shooting something off this direction. I see nothing. My my friendly plane knows where this guy is, so I'm keeping an eye out. I can hear quite a lot of aeroplanes. It's another IS too. Okay. As long as we are laying the damage on quite thick and we get assists, we might actually get enough spawn points to do something. Uh, enemy in the tree up there. I have absolutely no idea where he is, but we're about to find out. If our teammates just went back and get some more bombs and stuff, we might be okay here. I think this IS-2 has been up here since the beginning of the game. I'm going to have to go back and land and come back. And I think we actually have time. Okay, breaches out. No crew damage. Four rounds left of actual damage in rounds. Where is my teammate calling out what? Requesting air reconnaissance, he says. The IS-2 is trying to move. I think I can maybe cripple this IS-2 with my last four rounds so my Sherman can hit this guy. So that's good. We are going to go back and land. We have exactly six minutes left, so not an awful lot of time. Good luck, Mr. Medium Tank. Don't mess this up. I've given you a fighting chance, and we are even on tickets right now. You cheer out. We are now plus on tickets, which leaves us with uh, 130 spawn points before Nook. I had no idea playing that rocket not thing would be so involved. This is going to be a really... Sketchy belly land. I don't remember doing it this fast before. Right, okay, we just damaged one engine, we're okay. So negative on the elevator, it should slow us down a bit more. And we're down. Here comes a friendly 110. I'm really scared of this console player. I'm gonna fly in front of him so he can't actually shoot me with his rear gunner as easy. Or Cap and B though. It's just the IS-2 that's left. 
He's pushing our guy on B. Oh, I get some altitude. He's going to the A cab. I don't. They must be new. They must be new, dude. Okay, teammate's gonna get the bomb. No, they're not. But this dude is not doing too great. We're about to cap B. Oh my god, this guy is anime plot armor. We're not gonna get the last kill. <laughs> He's gone. <laughs> GG. It's too late. He capped it. I asked if I could nick. Aye, it's too late. M Momko capped the point at the end. Anyway, we, we got it. Wow, the Silver Lion aliens. Amazing. 16 kills, 2 deaths, 3 assists. And we get 85,000. It's so bad. So yeah, this thing is exactly how I expected it to be, it's very good as long as you can play it well, it'll be very squishy if you don't, and because it's on the German side, it's probably going to stay 7.3 for quite a while. The thing that annoys me most about this tank and the Ush is it really appeals to players who play like the R3, who just like to rush in, get a quick kill, jump on an aeroplane, and because you can spam 18 rockets without a reload in one of these things, you're definitely going to get a kill or two. And I don't know, for gameplay sake, I don't think that's a great thing. But it is fun, and if you enjoy fun, then go get this tank, because it's hilarious. Anyway, thank you guys for watching today, I really appreciate you all being here. I had no internet for almost a whole week, which is why I didn't have a video out. I tried to play War Thunder on a mobile connection. <laughs> but it just kicked me out of lobbies and that was no fun at all. I didn't even get a single kill. I didn't even get to see an enemy tank. By the time I got to the middle of the map, it just disconnected me and that was unfortunate. I thought it'd be a really funny experience, like a Australian War Thunder simulator, uh, but it didn't happen. So we're back with an internet connection, so I'll be making a video every single day. As always, a huge thanks to everyone over on Discord and Patreon for supporting the channel. I really, really appreciate you guys. For all the tier threes that support me over on Discord, that's Flubberino, Toast McGee, D Back is Sexy, White Wolf, Audible Bow, Bofe, The Saints Fan, Distari, Fearless Germ, Mushy, Rusty, Stein, Wrecked Wolf, and Zig. And of course, to everyone over on Patreon, that's Sickness Win, Matthew S, Finlay, Paul Hendricks, The Tackle Guy, FTM Watermelon, Shane McGuire, Ahenius, and the Storm Run, Brandon, aka The Flying Pickle, NB1 Kenobi, Ethan Excavation, Nation Handsome, The Tia, Kim the Salt Lord, Level Weasel, Ralph, Ride, Shaft, Tactonic, Tanks Gone Well, The Anomaly, Vanny, and Warpig, The Saints. <laughs> I don't know why it's so hard to read on Patreon. The Saints fan, Mortanen, Stoyan, David, Pyrophoric, and the one, the only, Rosalini. And to everyone else still here, thank you very much for watching. Much love and bye bye.